Welcome to Billy Review Stuff, where I review stuff. Today I'm looking at Mythic Legion's All Stars 5 Plus Swig, the alchemist of Gob Hollow, uh, creating uh, invisibility elixirs, strength elixirs, uh, all sorts of stuff, and probably blowing people up too. So uh, watch out. And of course, he's a member of the Aerith faction. So let's take a look. So after taking a second and fiddling around with Swig, I, I love goblins. Goblins, I'm I'm very biased about it because they are they're they're mischievous looking, they're evil looking. I adore them. Let me let me get him in a little closer here and get the zoom off that. Let's see here. So just just look at that face. That's a face only a mother could love, and even then I don't think they have where they reproduce that way. So it's it's amazing what went into this. Just just from like reuse of parts. And then a new head that probably was in the can for a while, honestly. It's it's fantastic. You have the, the 1.0 sized hands on the 2.0 sized arms. It, it just adds to that like oddball nature of goblins. Um, honestly, I kind of want to swap out a bunch of hands on like the goblins I have now because like the, the 2.0 hands are a little dainty. I like the I like the 1.0 hands on there. It just kind of adds to that like exaggeration. Um, the soft goods from C. Jessam have where it's, it's wonderful. They are different from the other ones have where it's stitched in a little bit here to make it a little bit tighter right there. Um, and then it has like a, the, the skirt piece going around the back just adds to it. It's a very shiny purple. I like it. Uh, honestly, like if I get another one, I might put it on, um, oh God, what is it? There's so many characters. Uh, it's not Poxus. It's uh, so, 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 Basilia, and it's the, maybe it's, maybe it's uh, some Spirit Bender or something like that. It's one of them. It's one. It's the blue lady with the tattoos. Uh, I'll pop the name up here probably, but like, I'll probably put it on her to give her some soft goods because like, it, it looks, it looks great and I think it'll match. Um, another unexpected thing that I, I, like, when this is coming out, I was like, okay, we're getting another... 2.0 goblin head but then it turns out that like he he has a like the father christmas 2.0 to 1.0 size neck peg so you can put like those father christmas heads on here and have that now which is which is fantastic because that's what i was doing with the father christmas deck i was going like there you go you got a you got a big head goblin fantastic uh now it's it's Easy peasy lemon squeezy once you buy like a bunch of swigs. And I've pulled off his neck now. Let me see if I can pop this out. Oh my god. These these heads really good. Really sturdy. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Back in action. He also comes with a uh, gripping hand and another kind of casting hand there. They're both uh, left and right hinges on there. Um, a, uh, a bone sword. A bone sword there. Uh, and a belt, plus my favorite thing, a Ziploc bag. Love them. But uh, if you don't have a swig, if you don't have a lot of goblins, and you want to get into goblins, or if you just are willing to give them a try, pick up swig, you're going to love them. You can swap out his head with other goblin heads, or even helmeted heads, have oversized knight heads on them, because like, you could just... If you, you're definitely getting a Xy Learning Guard. If you're watching this video, you you should get a Xy Learning Guard. But then you can take that extra head and just stick on here. Look at that. There you go. He has an oversized knight head now. It's all these neat little things. Make this amazing. I might up uh, update my uh, Sir... Oh, God. If I can remember the name of the made-up names, I'd make it for my goblins. Sir... Something. Whatever. But, uh, yeah, just... Pick one up. You'll enjoy him. If anything, he's good for popping and swapping. And he's got, oh, he's even got that oversized belt. His oversized belt just like adds to the, again, the piecemeal nature of goblins. It's, it's fantastic. Oh, and he has this cool dagger. If I can pull it out. Not the chosen one. There we go. Yeah. Pointy. But, uh, like, share, comment. Come on. Let me know if you love goblins. And uh, see you next time.